We are a few weeks into the new school year and the Osceola County School District says they are still struggling to find enough bus drivers. And today they held a hiring event to help try and alleviate that issue. As West Chew's Tony Atkins reports, the district has a desperate call for dozens of drivers. Three weeks into the academic year, the school district of Osceola County finds itself looking for 30 bus drivers. Today we have 23 planned bus routes that do not have a regular daily driver. Randy Wheeler, the district's transportation coordinator, says the driver shortage forces the team to be creative when finding routes to make sure no student is left behind. Every school district in the country almost is experiencing the pain. Uh, Osceola here, we're no different. The role of mapping out the routes falls to David Pizarro, who says having less drivers makes work that much more challenging. The students that use the bus service, they're close to 40,000. Mm -hmm. So uh, it's very difficult to try to uh, make sure that all students get to school, and that's the reason we have drivers uh, doing more than one route a day. The district says it plans to have monthly job fairs to help with recruitment. This one marked the first of the school year. Would-be drivers start out at $15 an hour as they train, then pay jumps to $16.50 after they've completed training as a full-time driver. The $16 pay rate, a $3 jump from a year ago. We have a lot of positions open to the public, so I encourage everybody that is interested in, and be part of the Osceola County School District. Tuesday's job fair had a low turnout, but people like David Ayala says he's already experienced and licensed, and he's ready to take on the role. I'm, I'm happy because I've done it before, so I've been in the field, so why not? And even if you weren't able to make it to today's job fair, you can come to the district anytime if you're looking for work. Report